guys how you doing it's your girl here miss hawaii and this is your general love reading for october 5th of 2021 it's so good to see you guys and thanks for being here for personal readings you can email miss hawaii readings at gmail.com that's miss hawaii readings at gmail.com it does take one to two weeks to get you the reading if you need to expedite it you can pay an expedited fee and i'll get you the reading within 24 hours or by the next day so that's miss hawaii readings at gmail.com i look forward to hearing from you if you haven't followed me on instagram yet go ahead and click that instagram link or go to your instagram app and go ahead and follow miss hawaii tarot i would greatly appreciate it libras and there's also a link below that will take you to the Facebook page for Miss Hawaii Tarot. If you have Facebook, would you be so kind to go ahead and like that page? I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you for all your continuous support. Shout out to everybody that's ever left a donation on this channel. Thank you for all your donations, your cash apps, your Zells. Thank you for all the super chats last night. And if you would like to donate, there is information below that will take you to, that will give you all the information about um, donating if you want to donate to this channel. There's also a link that will take you to the extended reading. If you feel like this reading is resonating with your heart and your soul, I would love to see you over on Vimeo. All right. And the extended, I pull your person's card, see how they feel about you, what actions they'll be taking moving forward towards you. And I also get advice for you from the universe. All right. So that's the extended reading link. And it's in the description box below. I look forward to seeing you all there. If not, I'm happy that you're here. All right. The join button as well as below. If you would like to become a member of this channel, you get access to private readings that are only for my members all right so go ahead and click that join button especially if you've been watching my readings for a while and they resonate you should be a member and we would love to have you there all right and don't forget to like comment share and subscribe that shows your support for this channel click that little subscription bell that's a little bit below the video that will notify you every time i go live or i post a new video and that's another way of showing your support for this channel and if you have time go ahead and subscribe to my other channel which is Miss Hawaii's Scorpios, all right? So let's see what's going on, Libra. Let's see what's going on, how you've been feeling in love. How have you been feeling in love, Libras? Oh, we got two cards that came out for you. Oh, the Justice in Reverse and the Ten of Cups. Your Major Arcana card came out. Okay, wow, what's going on, Libra? With the Ten of Cups, okay. Wanting your wish fulfillment, but possibly feeling like this person isn't giving it to you with the justice in reverse. Some of y'all are going through a divorce or a separation. Two of cups. Wow. So you definitely got a soulmate connection with somebody or a bond or I'm seeing mutual attraction here. Um, but I don't like that your justice card came out in reverse. The hermit in reverse. Some of y'all dealing with a Virgo or another Libra. Okay. Hmm. That's interesting energy. Somebody's your wish, wish fulfillment. I see a strong connection between the two of you. But I also feel like either this person is being dishonest towards you, not treating you right, okay? Or you feel that you're not being treated right. And they could be kind of either withdrawn with the hermit in reverse. Maybe they are keeping their distance from you. Um, let's see. How does this person feel about Libra? five of pentacles in reverse huh so that could be your energy that's withdrawn the queen of wands in reverse some of y'all dealing with a fire sign aries leo or sagittarius the ten of wands oh that's the two of wands in reverse okay one more card for how this person feels about libra The Four of Cups. Hmm. Bottom of the deck is the Ace of Wands. Okay, this is interesting energy. Uh, what's under that? The King of Wands in reverse. The Star in reverse. Could be an um, Aquarius some of you guys are dealing with. Okay. Um, let's see what the hell is going on here. So far, it seems like... I'm getting, some of y'all have kids too. I'm seeing families. That's beautiful energy. I'm getting somebody you, you can see a happily ever after with. Somebody that you see a love connection with. Somebody you feel something strong with this person. Um, they make you happy. But I'm getting that sometimes either this person can be distant. 
um, or maybe you're distancing yourself from this person because with the justice in reverse, you're a major arcana card. Like I said, that indicates that the scales aren't balanced here. Somebody here was either dishonest, treated the other unfairly, okay? And it could be why somebody is either the hermit in reverse. Now, the hermit in reverse can mean one of two things. It can mean somebody is being withdrawn or it can mean somebody wants to come out of that withdrawn energy and wants to kind of allow themselves to be seen, um, to be around you. Your, your intensity is here though. I, I see this person is definitely a strong part of what your happily ever after is or your wish fulfillment. And the two of cups is, there's a bond. There's, there's, there's an attraction here. Now your person is pulling kind of stuck energy because um, the four of cups usually means that someone's discontent. They're discontent with the current situation. Things are not being handled the way they like it or things are not going the way they want it to go. Um, let's go ahead and see what's going on here. Let us see what is going on here. Show me the Ten of Cups, please. Show me the Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups, Ten of Cups. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Why is the Ten of Cups here? The Queen of Swords in reverse. With the Four of Cups in reverse. Libra, for some of y'all... What, what is going on with your energy? Your energy is kind of like, <laughs> it's kind of like your sign, the scale. It's like up and down, up and down. A part of you is like, you want this person. They make you happy. But why are you pulling the queen of swords in reverse? Either you've been through enough with this person. This person has put you through a lot for some of y'all. Or this person has made you have that sword in your hand. Because I'm seeing heartbreak on your end. I'm seeing heartbreak, but I'm feeling like you either want to come, you want to come out of that heartbreak energy or you want to either reconcile or something about forgiveness or something like that. Um, show me the queen of swords in reverse. The star in reverse. Put more Aquarian energy with the hermit card again, Virgo energy. It's like you care about this person. You can see they make you happy. But why are you losing hope here with the star in reverse? Like either you are, you're a bit discouraged right now with this connection. That's why you're the queen of swords in reverse. There could be some trust issues here. Let's see the justice card in reverse. The lovers. Whoa. Whoa. With the devil. Oh. Capricorn energy. You got a lot of major arcana cards. A lot going on with you right now. Your energies are very intense. This is somebody. I'm getting a soulmate bond you have with somebody. Or somebody you madly in love with. Or somebody that you. Hello. Two of cups. Devil and the lovers. So for a lot of y'all, you love this person. There's a soulmate bond. Like you always feel a pull towards this person. Like it's like this person just literally like makes you melt. But it's also has, it's, it's like you're kind of like addicted here with the devil card. There could be some toxicity here. I'm not even gonna lie, Libra. It feel like y'all in love with somebody that that does a lot to you, that hurts you sometimes. Justice again in reverse. Look. From two different decks. You got it twice here. It's like you, it's like you're in love with somebody. You feel a soulmate bomb pull with somebody, but it's also somebody that's either not treating you right. Or somebody that did some dirty shit to you. Or somebody that was dishonest. Or somebody that's just not giving you what you deserve. Because the devil is here. It's like an attachment. It's like an addiction. But it can also sometimes feel like it's unhealthy. Wow, your shit is intense this week. Some of y'all, it's another Libra. Or it's a Gemini. Let's see the two of cups. Your energy is like... Strong. Now, the energy could always be reversed. 
Show me the two of cups. The star in reverse and the hierophant in reverse. Taurus energy. You keep getting the star in reverse. I think you got this a lot in your last reading. You're so like all over the place. The page of cups in reverse. And the reason why I say you're all over the place is because your feelings are so intense, but then it's also like, you don't know if you believe in this anymore, if you have hope in this anymore, because you keep getting the star in reverse. Like, do I still have hope in this? I'm discouraged. There's a connection, but show me the star in reverse. And then you got the page of cups in reverse. Some of y'all, this person is too emotionally immature. The devil flipped over. Again, the devil is here. Capricorn energy. Wow. With the death card. Oh my God. You got so much major arcana cards this week. You got so many. Something is toxic here. This connection either feels unhealthy, but it's like you love it. <laughs> it's like it's so strong. It's like your feelings are so intense, but it's like you either feel addicted, obsessed with this person. Maybe this person could be giving you that type of energy. Wow. Let's see the hermit in reverse. The devil in reverse. Oh my God, you got the devil all up in your reading. Some of y'all definitely dealing with a Capricorn or you got Capricorn in your chart. The queen of cups in reverse. You're trying to emotionally detach here, but it's hard because your feelings are so strong. But it's like, you don't want this toxic energy. It's like, you don't want nobody to have you like this. And be fucking with your emotions. Have emotional control over you like this. So some of y'all are trying to emotionally detach. Wow, this is deep here. Your money look good. <laughs> with the nine of pentacles I saw. Let me see your person here. What the fuck? Show me the five of pentacles, please, in reverse. the star okay so your person pulling the star upright with the sun could be a leo or an aquarius they got the four cups again so i think your person can feel here that your energy is like you're not too happy about things right now um but they're pulling the star like they actually have hope in this connection they actually have faith here in this If you have withdrawn, it's like this person wants you to come out of the, they want to come out of the doghouse, as I call it. Show me the queen of wands in reverse. The queen of wands in reverse. Oh my God. With the king of wands. Oh, Libra, y'all energy off the chain. You and this person, who is this? It could be an Aries, a Leo, or Sagittarius. Whoa. Whoa. Queen of Wands in reverse with the Queen of Wands in reverse from two different decks. Some of y'all, this ain't for everybody. Some of y'all, this person is married or they in another relationship already. That could be the problem. Um, wow. Show me the Queen of Wands in reverse, please. The Nine of Swords in reverse and the Chariot. Could be a Cancer. I think this person can feel your energy kind of like trying to, ooh, trying to release this hole. Trying to release this hole, trying to, to break this shit. Cause, but it's so strong. Let me see the two of wands in reverse. Two of swords in reverse and the three of pentacles in reverse. You see, some of y'all, yeah, this is a third party situation. 
or your person can feel your energy here. Strength in reverse, Leo energy. Knight of Wands in reverse. Some of y'all, the problem here is a future with this person. Like, if this person is not in a third party situation, then it's like this person kind of like they want to have you, but they want to do what they want to treat you however they want to treat you. Meaning, it can mean dating other people, it can mean fucking other people, it can mean talking to their ex, baby mama, baby daddy, whatever the case may be. Or just not give you commitment, not give you stability in this connection. That's what I'm getting. It's like this person doesn't want to take the steps here to move forward here with you. I'm getting heavy um, air, um, fire energy for your person. Show me the uh, strength card, please, in reverse. The queen of wands in reverse. <laughs> Oof, with the high priestess in reverse. Again, the queen of wands is here again in reverse. Yeah, some of y'all, this person kind of want to do their own thing. But they want you. <laughs> it's like, I want, I want Libra, but I just want to do my own thing too. I want to, yeah. I don't want to cooperate. Show me the two of wands in reverse. I mean, show me the, the four of cups. The four cups. Wow, your energy is fire today. With the five of wands. I'm seeing a lot of drama around this person. It's like your person is... They don't like what is going on currently between the two of y'all. But I feel like your person is taking you for granted. I really am getting that for a lot of y'all. Like, they're not seeing your worth. They are. They're, they're taking you for granted. I feel like they're playing games with you. Four of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, I feel like this person is like... And for some of y'all, that sex is bomb with that Ace of Wands. The shit is bomb, but it's like... I need your person to put in more work. I need your person to show they want this more. And I'm not feeling like they are. With that justice in reverse, it can mean a divorce. Some of y'all could be a divorce or a separation, breakup, whatever the case may be. Your person is just kind of like in some type of stuck energy right now. Like, I don't think they want to be mad at you. I don't think they want to let you go. I don't think they want you to let them go. But I just feel there's a... Um, a wall here this person is hitting to take this connection to the next level that could have been the problem here maybe that's why y'all are withdrawn but your person is in a stuck energy with the two of wands in reverse and the four cups it's like they discontent like they unhappy right now but whatever is the current state status here between you and them some of y'all, this person got an anger problem or a temper or they need to work on their attitude. Give me three Kipper cards here for this person, please. Dealing with Libra. Marriage. Ooh. Yeah, some of y'all, I did say divorce. Some of y'all are actually married to this person. I hope this person ain't married to somebody else. <laughs> Or it could be maybe y'all discuss the marriage. Maybe you could see yourself marrying this person. Or you did at one point. Main female popped out. So some of y'all, this got something to do with somebody's main. Maybe you are their main or you were their main. One more card, please, for this person. How does this person feel about Libra? Toil and labor. Wow, with the great fortune here. I think this person does know that you are something special. I feel like they do, but I feel like with the toil and labor card, it's like they feel like this connection is gonna is a lot of hard work. Or it's gonna be a lot of hard work or something like that. Some of y'all, maybe this is somebody you work with with the toil and labor card. Somebody you used to work with. 
I'm seeing hard work. Like this person either feels like this connection is a lot of hard work. Hmm. Interesting. All right, let's go into the extended. I'm gonna pull your person's cards, okay? We're gonna see what actions they're gonna be taking moving forward towards you. Get some more of um, a feel of for how they feel and um, we'll get advice for you from the universe Libra. I hope this helped you guys some. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe and the link to the, this, the, the link to the extended is in the description box below. I hope to see you guys there over on Vimeo. If not, I'm happy that you're here and um, I'll see you guys next time. Have a great week. Bye.